This video will demonstrate how to install microstructure probes on Rockland Scientific Turbulence Instruments with seal compression plate probe holders. The MicroCTD is used for demonstration purposes. The MicroCTD profiler with the front bulkhead seen here has the following probes and sensors. Microconductivity 1, Temperature 1, Shear 1, and Shear 2. A reference CT made by JFE Advantech Corporation, Jack, and an optional chlorophyll and optical backscatter sensor also made by Jack. The pressure sensor diaphragm is located in the center of the front bulkhead. The seal compression plate is secured by two hex screws. The x-axis of the micro CTD is through these screws, positive away from the shear probes. The y-axis is positive to the left, or port. To install probes, use a 5 32nd inch or 4 mm hex wrench to loosen the two screws securing the compression plate. Loosen the compression plate only 2 to 3 mm. Loosening more than 2 to 3 mm may cause the o rings to dislodge. Remove the compression plate to check the o rings and sealing surfaces frequently. Next, ensure the seal is broken and remove the test probes. If an o-ring is still creating a seal, then a vacuum can form behind the probe or test probe as it is removed, causing water to be sucked into the probe port cavity. Keeping the probe connectors dry and free of corrosion is essential to ensure the functionality of the instrument. Carefully remove the protective covering from the microconductivity probe. Always install probes starting from the least fragile. The microconductivity probe is the least fragile, followed by the shear probes and then the temperature probes. Make a note of the channel name on the test probe and the serial number on the probe. For shear and temperature probes, carefully remove the probe from its protective sheath. Carefully and gently insert the probes into the port. Do not use force. Ensure the probes are fully seated. It is very important to keep the probes and the probe ports clean and dry. Try to minimize twisting of the probes once they are connected. As you install the shear probes, ensure that they are oriented correctly. Typically one shear probe is aligned with the instrument's x-axis and the other with the y-axis. The sensitivity on a shear probe is in the direction normal to the flat section of the probe's serial number. Once the microstructure sensors are installed, fully seated, and properly oriented, Tighten the screws on the seal compression plate only until no gap exists between the plate and the front bulkhead. Do not tighten the compression plate further as you risk damaging the threads in the front bulkhead. The compressed o-rings will prevent accidental loosening of the screws. Keep the test probes in the protective sleeves with connectors covered while the instrument is being deployed. The seal compression plate probe holder is used on other instruments including the MicroRider 1000G and the MicroRider 6000S. The probe installation technique described in this video applies to any instrument with a seal compression plate probe holder.